Hi everyone, it is Danielle with Woodhaven Craft Fabulous again. Again. All right. Do I have some showy stuff for you? No, it's just a yarn haul. <laughs> um, Joanne's, I think it was last week. It's last week. Yes, on Valentine's Day. Um, they were doing some sales. Um, I don't know if I have the receipt to give you guys. Oh, I don't because I had to return a cute little dog sweater that I had bought that did not fit my cute little puppers that I now have. My parents got a puppers. And if you follow me on Instagram, you can see the pictures of the puppers. The puppy is so cute. It is adorable. And it rules now my life. So. I don't have the receipt. I don't know the exact prices of what I paid for these items. Um, but I remember the total minus the dog sweater was like around 45, 42-ish. That range. Um, we're just going to get started. And when I went to Joanne's, I was thinking, hmm, what can I make with this item? There's a couple different things that I want to make. There's a cat pillow that I want to make. Um, there is a wolf, no, a fox amigurumi that I would like to make that I have gotten in my crochet world patterns, um, because I do subscribe to crochet world magazine, um, and crochet exclamation point magazine. I don't, I don't know if it's separate. I think they go through the same company, but it's a different magazine. I don't know. Um, but anyways, let's, let's get started. Let's, let's get started. So for the cat pillow on the picture, it's like this bright pink and red cat. Um, I got a giant thing of pink. So I think this can make two of the pillows that I want to make. So there's that. Oh, well, I guess I should go over the specs with you guys. So we've got Pretty in Pink. That is the colorway. Uh, there's a free pattern inside. It looks like it's a cute little baby blanket. Do, 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 do. Oh, wait, no. Yes. Maybe. Pattern on back, yes. <laughs> okay. And you can also find free patterns at redheart.com because that's what I read first. And I was like, yay, free pattern. But uh, the, the blanket on the front is knit. So this is 14 ounces, 396 grams, 744 yards, or 681 meters. It is Super Saver Jumbo Red Heart Yarn, medium four. Use a 5.5-millimeter hook. It is 100% acrylic. And if you guys just watched my Impeccable Review, this is much softer than P Impeccable Review. So if you guys already know what Red Heart Super Saver feels like, it's, you know, not the softest yarn, but Impeccable Loops and Threads. Is scratchier than this so that's to give you guys an idea of my impeccable yarn um, but back to super saver jumbo I am also I'm not associated with any of these yarn companies I'm not associated associated with Joann's Red Heart uh, any of the other companies I'm going to show you today um, I'm not affiliated with them I don't know if I ever will be I doubt it but you know it'd be kind of cool if I was um, but yes, there's that one. It smells like Joann's. I've worked for a Joann's before. Did you guys know that? I worked there for like two months and then I, uh, I, I got another job, which was very sad because I loved working at Joann's. I love doing what I love. So, and then I was very sad. Another yarn. This one is for the Amigurumi Fox that I would like to do a couple of for my shop. Karen, one pound. Um, I think my fox is a little more orange than this, 
but you know it's always good to have variations uh, this is Karen One Pound by Yarnspirations, 16 ounces, uh, 453.6 grams. It is 812 yards. 100% um, acrylic, softer than the Red Heart, uh, medium four, five millimeter hook, this is golden, the colorway is golden. Free pattern, oh my gosh, you guys, I think I found my next pattern. Sorry if you can hear the garbage truck outside, it is garbage day. Tuesday is our garbage day. I think I found my next project. You guys, that kind of sucks because blankets take forever. But it is very cute. That's a very cute pattern, and I will be keeping that pattern. But that's the golden yarn that I got for my um, fox amigurumi. Homespun yarns were buy one, get one half off, so I got this black yarn because I've had somebody for two weeks now looking for a black scarf. Um, and then the half off one, I got this one, which is much cuter, you guys. I love it. I sound really weird. Um, so yes, this is black. It is a bulky five. You can use a 6.5 millimeter hook. 185 yards, 98% acrylic, 2% other fiber. Don't know if it comes with a free pattern, but this is what is shown on the yarn. And they do have a lot of patterns on their website that are free, that I enjoy. That's where I got my baby poncho pattern. And I think the... The infinity scarf was off of a YouTube pattern. Um, <clears throat> and then this one, basically the same specs, 185 yards, bulky, 6.5 millimeter hook or six millimeter needles. Oh, machine washable or dryable. Huh? Well, no, and dryable. A uh, colorway is mixed berries and I absolutely find it stunning. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. It caught my eye, so I got it. Um, and then I needed blue because I'm making another unicorn. Um, I A friend of mine is ordering one from me. Um, and he wanted his wife to have a purple and blue uh, unicorn. So I got... Do, 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 do. Please don't be connected to anything. I got Great Fizz. I got some grape is a red heart super saver variegated yarn oh my gosh and now that pattern is really really pretty please be knit so i don't do you i don't know because it doesn't give me that take a peek in there <sighs> it is 236 yards which one of these will make an entire unicorn excluding horn and hair and the polyfiber on the inside um <clears throat> so yes it is grape fizz medium four weight 5.5 millimeter hook 100 percent acrylic 236 yards yeah there's that one and i got two of these i got two of them um, I'm already halfway through the other one because I'm making the unicorn. <clears throat> and then I got the blue for the hair because I have, a, I realized I have a lot of purple. I don't have a lot of blue or green in my stash. So, mm. and in my Joann's haul, I bought a bunch of buttons 
because this was the last thing of yarn and I don't want it I don't want you guys to think like oh my goodness only seven skeins of yarn is forty two dollars no I bought five five packs of buttons um and then I was going to say something, but now my brain just went like this. Oh yeah, I did make one other purchase with the yarn. So the yarn was not the only thing I bought. Um, or the buttons. I bought five buttons, seven skeins of yarn, and a book. Um, I've been really wanting to get into crochet socks, and now that I can read patterns fairly well... Um, I bought myself a book. Um, these are not all of the patterns, but I don't really want to go through the book, show you guys all of them and give away the, you know, the patterns um, because of copyright stuff. Just so you guys know, I, if, I buy a, if I buy a pattern, I do not share it with anybody um, because there's copyright things I feel like the designers of the item should get credit for it so if you guys ever ask me for a pattern that I paid for I'm sorry um, but if I do have extra patterns that are typically free just laying around I will send it to you um, just like my extra knit crates because I typically get two knit crate books every month I don't need two I have an extra one so if I'm doing like a giveaway I will throw one of these in there um so yeah um one of the socks not shown is that one that one's pretty cute that one's an ankle sock. One of the ones that I'm very excited about doing that was not shown. I've got to find it. I don't think it's this far. It's not this far in the book. Where are you? There you are. Do, 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 do. It's a cute little yoga sock. I'm trying to get it without a glare. Look at that yoga sock. Mm. I really want to pair those just so I can wear them around the house. And they look fairly simple to make, so I'm pretty excited about it. It just doesn't really give, you know, a measurement of like what size foot needs to go into it. Or what size foot I'm making it for. Which is a little arc, but you know. It happens. There is a total of nine sock patterns in here. And I love every single one of them. Even the sock warmers. Or leg warmers. Um, and I'm excited to do a bunch of them and show you guys. So, um, if you guys have any questions, leave them down in the description. And... If you guys like this video, like, comment, and share... Um, I always love reading your guys' comments. Um, I know it's been a while since I've done a bunch of videos like these, but I, I'm also not going to promise you guys that I'm going to do a bunch of videos like these because every time I do, I get overly stressed out and there's a bunch of internal turmoil. So yeah, I am now going to clean up my glorious display mess that I have just made and I will see you guys later. Bye.